Now we're working with division. Remember that in order to divide, what I need is to multiply the divisor and the dividend by the conjugate of the divisor. Okay. So I'm looking here at 4 plus 2i. It's conjugate. It's complex conjugate is 4 minus 2i. So I need to multiply this numerator and denominator by 4 minus 2i. OK, in the numerator, I'm going to go ahead and do my FOIL. First gives me 2 times 4, which is 8. Outer terms, this is 2 times negative 2i, that is negative 4i. Inner terms, negative 3i times 4 is negative 12i. Last terms, negative 3i times negative 2i is plus 6i squared. Now, in the denominator, I, can act, I could use FOIL and multiply it out, or I could remember that if I multiply con complex conjugates, a plus bi times a minus bi, what I'm going to end up with is a squared plus b squared. Now, looking at 4 plus 2i, here a equals 4 and b equals 2. So let me just take that shortcut and say that I then have a squared, which is 4, so 4 squared plus b squared, which is 2 squared. Okay. Now, simplifying the numerator a bit further gives me 8 negative 4i minus 12i is negative 16i plus 6i squared. In the denominator, 4 squared is 16 and 2 squared is 4. Okay, recall that i squared is negative 1. So I'm going to substitute negative 1 here. The denominator, I've just got 16 plus 4 is 20. Okay, so this gives me 8 minus 16i. This is negative 6 over 20. I can simplify a bit more because 8 minus 6 is 2. This is 2 minus 16i over 20 is my solution. Okay, so in order to simplify this, I took the conjugate of the denominator, which is 4 minus 2i, and I multiplied both the divisor and the dividend by, the by the, this uh, conjugate, this complex conjugate. In the denominator, it was easy because I just said, okay, that's this conjugate, multiplying these conjugates gives me a squared plus b squared. So that's 4 squared is 16, and 2 squared is 4 to get 20. In the denominator, I used FOIL. I multiplied these out just as I normally would to get this. I combined like terms to get 8 minus 16i plus 6i squared. And then I said, OK, i squared is negative 1, allowing me to simplify this into negative 6 and combining 8 minus 6 to get 2 minus 16i over 20. OK, that concludes this session of Educator.com, introducing complex numbers and imaginary numbers.